the process that I go through for each painting tends to be like uh, the same. Everything starts with the drawing first. I like the juxtaposition of doing cartoons but using the, the, the same process as Renaissance painters. The script for the painting really writes itself. I just went surfing on a, a Sunday afternoon. I was supposed to be going down to meet uh, a mate of mine, but I couldn't find him, so I was just surfing on my own for a while, and I knew to be wary of sandbars, and I've caught a wave, and obviously I've just drifted over a sandbar. The wave's gone over the sandbar, and it's gone miles bigger than I anticipated it to be, and it's just, just turned me upside down and landed me on my head. I couldn't move my fingers, couldn't turn my hands over. I got rolled around in the next uh, in a few waves. It's not that I thought I was going to die, I knew I was going to die. Real nice guy called Chris, just, um, he was out teaching his daughter how to surf. Uh, he found us in the, in, in the water, cut my uh, board off me, or undid my board, put me on um, his daughter's foamy and just used it as a, a stretcher to get me out and uh, pulled me out. You know, I'd fallen directly on my head and the biggest bone in my neck's broken, which means there's no signal getting down after that C7 bone there. And I'm paralysed from the chest down. I started painting um, pretty much straight away in, uh, in hospital. I made some little paintings for me, um, for the staff that looked after me, like, and then just basically carried on from there. The accident like paralysed my fingers as well, and. Like I didn't get left with the full range of motion in them, so I could move them a tiny little bit. So that affected me because I, I couldn't do anything the same as I could do it before. Every little act that I ever did, I had to learn a new way to do. Now when you're in hospital, they just give you, for exercise for your hands, they give you a bag of nuts and a bag of bolts, and they just say, put the nuts on the bolts, and then once you're done, take the nuts off the bolts. But my hobby that I, that I love doing art, that's all it is, it's just picking up tubes of paint, twisting the top off, putting the top back on. I just had this like really, really lightweight hobby that was awesome for your dexterity and it's just unbelievable like how much it's helped my hands. And that's why in, in my original paintings uh, revolving around spinal cord injury, I really put like an emphasis on the hands. Like all the hands are like really big and over exaggerated as just kind of like to mimic the like the hands that that I was dealt with back then. I got my first exhibition coming up, really, and it's just the first one, really, that I've, I've put on all myself. I always get anxiety when I put a playlist on that I don't think everyone is gonna like. When you've put up all your work for people to come and have an opinion on, it's starting, uh, I'm getting really, really nervous now. But, uh, if someone says, right, um, you know, I'm interested in you, exhibiting at my gallery next year that's a that's a stepping stone you know to to carry on a career in this the accident has has given me the chance to do this painting it's not forced me to do this painting this is what what really what I want to do you know I've you know like you, you have an accident like mine and it forces you to give up absolutely everything you don't have a choice in it and so I'm choosing to do this many people have said it's nice to go in a gallery and understand what I'm looking at you know which is kind of my sentiments exactly I'm always going to be as critical as, of myself as I am I'm always trying to become better than than my last one and I think any kind of artist doesn't matter what medium you're working always thinks that I've tried hard and, and, and it's worked whether it leads anywhere or does anything you know that's for other people to, de to decide but you know if it doesn't go anywhere it's not because I didn't achieve what I set out to achieve you know I've, I've got my painting ability back to what it was before and now I've su surpassed that by 
Bye, Miles.